Jamani Dawson, you're watching Class Act Sports. Class X Sports is here with All Pro Center Damani Dawson of the Pittsburgh Steelers, and uh, you're a big time NFL alum. You know, talk about what we're doing here today, giving back to the kids. Well, I mean, it's always nice. I mean, you know, uh, most of the chapters we have events that, uh, and I'm not for sure exactly the charity that they're giving the money to, but it's always great to have the involvement of all the retired players. Um, and every retired player, they always support uh, the various chapters of the uh, NFLPA. Um, so, you know, I mean, it's just a great cause, and uh, that's why guys come out and, and support them. Well, you were a um, multiple all-pro all for the Steelers, you know, Pouncey, another great young talent they got at center for the Steelers. Talk about him a little bit. Uh, Marquise is going to be a phenomenal player, uh, you know, for him to make the Pro Bowl his uh, rookie year. And uh, you can just see his work ethic, ethic and, uh, you know, just the way he is as a player. Uh, and I think, you know, he's, he's driven and hungry, and I don't think he's going to rest on his laurels from last year. Uh, he's playing at a very high level, and I think he's going to be a good one for a long time. Now, the way the league's changed, you know, it seems like all the younger talent in the league wants to respond to a younger head coach like a Mike Tomlin, but still commands the respect. Uh, who would you have wanted to play for, a young-minded guy like that? Well, you know what? Hey, I had the privilege of playing with uh, Chuck Noll. Coach Noll was my uh, coach for four years, uh, my first four seasons, and then uh, Bill Cowher, my last nine seasons. So I got the best of both worlds, you know. Uh, you know, Coach Noll was uh, kind of a legend legendary coach and uh, I looked up to him and uh, respected him very much and then uh, Coach Cower came in and, and Coach Cower was a little closer to my age and um, you know he had that fire as well but you know both coaches had the fire and I'm just ha I'm just glad that I had the opportunity and cho uh, chance to uh, play for both of them so uh, um, I mean it was it was a great uh, run in Pittsburgh. Absolutely, and, and still is now with Tomlin. Talk about Coach Cowher. You think he's coming back soon, next year, maybe? Uh, you know, I'm not for sure. Um, you know, I'm, I know he's enjoying his broadcasting right now, and uh, and I'm sure if he gets the opportunity, uh, I'm sure that he will probably uh, coach again. You know, once you have that fire as a player and a, and a coach, hmm. and you leave the game, uh, you never leave the, lose that fire. So, or the the uh, desire to uh, play or coach, and uh, you know, sooner or later, I'd like to see him back in uh, uh, coaching. Absolutely, man. Well, great career in the NFL, and uh, we appreciate your time from Class X Sports. Well, thank you. I'm, I'm, I uh, apologize for my voice, but I was sick last week, and I lost my voice this week. And uh, it's starting to come back, but I'm, it's driving me crazy right, right now. Sounds good to the fans out there. They oh, wouldn't know hey. the difference. Thanks a lot, bro. All right. Thank you very much.